<laughs> Amazing. Wow. What a start, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you so much, ladies and gentlemen, please. Michelle Weinstein, thank you. Thank you. I got a nine. No. I'm only one point down. It's still anybody's game. Judging round two, please welcome a James Beard Award winner, Tyson Cole, ladies and gentlemen. Oh welcome. Hi, Chef. Good to see you, man. Good to be here. Let's start with Corey, please. I have done a truffle and mushroom risotto. The stock is chicken and porcini mushrooms to kind of enhance the flavor of the actual rice. Really strong mushroom flavor. I like that. The risotto itself, a little bit tight. Okay. But otherwise, really delicious. Thank yeah. you. Well done. Well Thank done. you. Great start. Declan, describe the dish to chef. Thank you. This is a pan-fried polenta cake finished with rosemary and parmesan, fresh tomato sauce, and then some fresh basil leaves. I like the flavors. Um, maybe the cake is a little bit dense. OK. Thank you. Mary Lou, describe the dish to chef, please. Um, what I have for you is some good old shrimp and grits. I rubbed them down with some blackening season and just finished with Tabasco beurre blanc. Love it. The flavor is great. Mm -hmm. Great cook on the shrimp. The yeah. spice was really refreshing. On a score of one to ten, let's start with Mary Lou first. I'm going ten. Ten. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Two tens off the bat. Shh. Shh. I'm knocking this shit out of the ballpark right now. Let's go to Declan's fried blender cake. I'm going. I'm going eight on that one, chef. Eight. Thank you. And then Corey's risotto, chef. Um. Also an eight, chef. An eight as well. Yes. Amazing. Ladies and gentlemen, Tyson Cole, thank you so much. Thank you. Very, very close. Round number three, the seafood round. Our next judge, she's a Julia Child award-winning chef and owner of Border Grill. Please welcome Susan Fenniger. I love this woman. She walks in and she looks like a mad artist. I'm excited. <laughs> Declan, pass you a dish and describe it to chef, thank you. What I'd like to do is to elevate fish and chips using cod, potatoes, peas, and then I have a turbo sauce with lemon juice and olive oil. Mm. Mm. <laughs> Chef. Yeah. Chef, would you like a glass of wine? Mm. Yeah. Where is my <laughs> wine? The service at this restaurant. <laughs> Chef. It's quite delicious. Chef, we have two more dishes to come. Oh. <laughs> I thought we were having dinner. So, I'm so dinner. sorry. Lock in those thoughts and we'll, uh, we'll move on. Otherwise... <laughs> Good job. Thank you. Mary Lou. Yes, Chef. Please describe your dish to Chef. Thank you. What I have is a pan-seared Chilean sea bass. It is going to be finished with a compound butter that has garlic, lemon juice, lemon zest. Yeah, that's really nicely cooked. The kale and fennel mix is really nice together. Thank you. Log in those thoughts. Wait a minute, wait, one more. Oh, sorry, bite. sorry. Of course. I like that's that a good sign. Really nice. Thank Very you. beautiful. Corey, please describe your dish. I did a nice red snapper, homemade chimichurri on the bottom, just kind of the way I used to do it in Mexico. I love the balance of the chimichurri on there, and I like the simplicity of that also. Thank you. Chef, I can get it to go for you yeah. as well after. Yeah, okay. would you? Yeah, please. Okay. Time to score these three incredible dishes. <laughs> Sorry. Let's start with Corey's dish first, please, on a scale of one to ten. <sighs> Chef? I think this dish is a... Oh, my God, if I mess this up, ah. Oh. Well, this is hard. It's the third round of judging. Renowned chef Susan Feniger will now judge the chef's fish course, starting with Corey's dish. On a scale of one to ten. Chef? I think this dish is a... a nine. A nine. Thank wow. You. Thank you. Mary Lou. I think this is a nine also. A nine also. Amazing. Nine also. Really Amazing. Really 